Hey, it's Richard Blackstone again with the uh, Game of Life, <laughs> played out on planet Earth, and uh, here today with our our Create One Love Note. A, a, it's a love note, especially for you. <laughs> yeah, it is. It's from me to you, and I love it. You know, this is how I serve every day is to uh, do these video love notes. You know, we do these love notes also in an email form. And uh, you can sign up for that by just going to Create One Love, and on the top there's a button that says Love Notes. Uh, just sign up for them, and you'll get them in your email every morning, because these love notes we're doing in video form are our archives. And so this is about a year old, um, uh, but they're all relevant. Yeah, I mean, they're all good. But if you want to get them every morning uh, to get your day going, and man, I get so many great comments about how it starts people's day. It's just the exact same thing they need to hear. So uh, if that tickles your fancy, then uh, go to Create One Love and just sign up there, and you can unsubscribe anytime. Okay, so let's uh, go ahead and read the love note, and then we'll talk about it. Okay, today's love note says, <coughs> You are on a journey, and your soul knows exactly the direction and the rhythm that your journey should take. Your soul, or spirit, is part of your being, and is part of you at all times while you are on your journey through physical existence, actually through eternity. But here's the deal. You enter this journey with the innate concept of free will. You, will. you have ultimate choice over how you choose to travel your journey. You can cultivate your relationship with your soul and use its guidance, or you can choose to do it your way. <laughs> Either way is okay because the journey always takes you back to your source. But the level of fun or frustration will be determined by your choice along the way. Now, free will is also free, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, you know, you have free will to, <coughs> you know, you may, once you understand that, you know, you have this cool relationship with your source, and the more you develop that relationship, the easier life gets, then you are at choice point, because you can choose to uh, ignore your spirit, your soul, your guidance system, or you can choose to use it to build a cool relationship and count on it at all times. And the advantage of doing so is that uh, you are, are privy to this guidance system that takes you to where you want to go. So w this is really important as a manifester because when you want to manifest one of your desires, you, you want it. So, so when you understand this system, uh, uh, and build a relationship with a guidance system that can take you there, then you get there a lot faster. You get to manifest your desires faster, smoother, easier, and it's more fun because your guidance system is always in alignment with joy. <laughs> so it's not going to take you through, you know, valleys of trepidation and, and all kinds of stuff unless you choose to through your free will. So uh, it's, it's just a fun thing, and uh, the number one relationship that you can build in your life, I mean numero uno, is your relationship to your source energy. That's, you know, basically your relationship to your spirit. And it's part of you anyway. I mean, it's with you forever. I mean, forever means eternity. Uh, so you are spirit. Actually, you've just got a kind of relationship with this body, although you're speaking through your body while you're playing this game. It's your spirit that is the actual you. <laughs> so uh, then, then it just behooves you. It just makes sense to develop this relationship and use it. You know, the uh, first 40 years of my life, I, I, I was clueless. I, you know, I, I knew I had a soul, but I didn't have any relationship with it per se. Um, <coughs> and then when I woke up to what I call my true authentic self, I realized that, man, I, I, I got a relationship with this, this spirit part of me that counteracts the ego part of me, and the more I build this muscle of my spirit, the more powerful I become because I'm tapping into the source of all power. <laughs> well, exponentially. So it's really a powerful thing you can do with your life. Develop a relationship with your spirit and use your spirit in your decision-making process. That is powerful. And believe me. Believe me. <laughs> hey, believe me. Please. <laughs> please. <laughs> no, you can believe me or not. I don't care. But uh, if you uh, choose to, you're going to see a difference in your life. And a very positive one. 
So we have tools to help you on that journey at Create One Love. And uh, the tool we've got today is called Get Blueprint for Manifesting. It's a ebook that's downloadable. You can uh, download it, read it in five minutes here. Um, it's called uh, The Three Foundation Pillars from the Blueprint for Manifesting System. And it is powerful. It is powerful. It's going to change your life. Now, how's that for free? <laughs> Best things in life for free. Yes. Okay, that's it for today. So I want you to go out. Have a lot of fun. That's a given, right? <laughs> and as always, live in love. One of the best things you can do. Hey, I'll see you tomorrow.